So I saw a discussion recently about whether or not private charity would be sufficient to cover the needs of the poor and disadvantaged. Um, and this is a common discussion that comes up with regards to libertarianism, because you know libertarians want to abolish the welfare state uh, and replace it with private charity. Uh, you know, and the question is, you know, is that going to uh, lead to masses of starving people in the streets? Um, you know, and <clears throat> to me, this is kind of missing the point. I'm with libertarians on this. I say yes, abolish the welfare state, fuck welfare, and fuck private charity too. Um, because here's the thing: charity and welfare are both basically compensating for an underlying injustice. Um, it's not about redistributing wealth. It's about uh, correcting the uh, the accumulation of wealth to begin with. Um, because so much of the inequality in society is based on the private ownership of, uh, of, of the commons, of you know, the natural world, of uh, the intellectual commons, of um, yeah, through, through like usury, uh, the um, sort of debt instruments like uh, uh, you know, like hedge funds and um, derivatives and things like that. And you know, basically, by taking wealth rather than creating wealth and getting rich off of it, um, that is what leads to you know gross income inequalities, and um, also holds useful wealth out of use, uh, which limits jobs, which means that workers have to compete, uh, you know, uh, you know, run over each other basically. Uh, to get jobs, when I when really it should be the reverse situation. It should be employers who are clamoring over each other to compete for workers. So, yeah, you know, I, I just think that um, it's the wrong frame frame of reference. Uh, so I guess that's my thoughts for now. Peace.